Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Space Engineers. Verlibus here. Totally didn't just spend ten minutes talking to nobody with the, the, the mic muted. Nope, not me. Flawless execution. Very well, then. Shall we continue? I built the crane. Xenomorph crane. Maybe. I don't know. It happened. Um, I continued on with the way we were doing it, so merging them all together. Someone had mentioned trying a blueprint to see if that would be a quicker way. I couldn't find a way for that to work. Couldn't get like a blueprint to go from connect to like two different piston heads. I don't think that's possible yet, but maybe one day. So I just did it the normal way and that worked out. And up top, it hooks up to a advanced rotor and that goes up, Ooh, got some damaged armor. That goes up to here, and at the top here, only this one piston line is actually being used, and it's that guy, and then he comes all the way down to a welder at ground level. Now, originally, I was going to try to make this thing a hinge so that it would fold up and fold back, which would allow us to move it up and down um, via that way, but... Uh, we do have a way of moving the whole thing up and down, so we can get that motion without adding that in. So I figured we'd go for the more basic variant first. And yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, well, here's the control area. So we're going to sit in here. Got some controls on the bar already. Although, uh, you are wrong. Need welder, crane, there you go. Toggle that on off. Good. And we got Skimmer over here. I did look at Skimmer over in a creative world and did a few minor adjustments. Um, I decided to keep the cargo containers in there because why not? And I added in a few welders here at the bottom. So they should help protect these lower drills. Some of them anyway. I don't know. There was room. I was like, why not? Let's throw some welders down there. We could probably put more in better locations to be honest, but we'll see. Other than that, I moved one of the sensors that I wanted to move. And I think that's about it. Added in this projector block so he can repair himself. And what else? I added in a computer block or a program block so that we can run a program, mainly for his speed, similar to Molar. And yeah, that's about all I did, really. Played around with some of the settings. I disabled some of the se sensors he had because... I don't need them if I'm using that program to moderate his speed. So yeah, w there'll be some tweaking with him once we get him running anyway. So, we have a camera here. It let's us look down. We can move the crane left and right uh, because of the gyros that are on it. So we're basically like turning a ship and it's pivoting around that advanced rotor. So we're able to do that because the advanced rotor is off right now. So it's not trying to fight us. So I don't Otherwise, it probably would. It's going back. But with it off, we just have to fight the braking force. So I just threw the braking force somewhere somewhere where it felt good. And that just means when I let go, that braking force is going to stop it from moving. So what we're going to do... I've got this guy positioned on our projector block down here. I have this camera, which isn't very good. I need to tilt it or something. It's very hard to see. So let's get out of the cockpit. Whoops. No, no, no. I said get out of the cockpit, not flail around in the cockpit. Are we good? Are we out? So I should probably put some more cameras in various locations to help us line all this stuff up. But as we can see, we are right above it. So it's probably a good place to start. Looks like we'll have to pull back a bit before the block will be placed. Or maybe move to the side. So we're going to see how well we can put this together using this. Uh, I am very hopeful, he said. Not hopefully. <gasps> it's working! Is it? I can't see anything. I turned it on. Okay, let's move to the side. And it should pop into existence. It's not even on. I picked like the wrong welder, didn't I? Oops. I have the tendency to throw that. Oh no, it's on. 
brilliant. Okay. Okay. Now we'll attach to that, right? Oh, no, no, don't kill me. I know. I said don't kill me. Okay, probably won't with that in there. I thought I moved it far enough out. Let's try again. Whoop. So let's go over here. Okay, we could try going up a bit more. So the controls here are on the thing. Did I show you? Can't remember. <laughs> Two will make it. Um, turns on the pistons that makes it go up and down. And then I can reverse, reverse directions with the key next to it. So now it's going back down. So that's my limited control there. And then I can boom out and back. So if I wanted to go further out, I could do so. Doesn't seem to be placing anything, does it? Okay, let's see. Oh, you know what? This thing isn't hooked up to anything. It doesn't have any parts. <laughs> I wonder if that could be the problem. Let's see if I... Don't worry about my health. There he's got... He might be a bit far away. He's got enough steel plates to place something. Yeah, I probably have to hook this up to our, our storage. Haha, ha, I kind of forgot about that. Um, are you going up or down? No, go down. Ooh, hello, beacon. Okay, so yeah, it placed. So we are just missing parts. Go see. What did you do? Place that, and now that's ready to go. Okay, so that should work. So we just have to pipe. Maybe from this guy over. And then we're good to go. Uh -huh. And steel plate. Your health is low. I know it. All fixed. Problem solved. I really bounced. Boing. Come back. Don't kill me. Take my drill. Goodbye. Okay. Sorry. It's all right. Sanity slept away. Slept away? With my consciousness. Did that make sense? I thought not. Okay. So if I just get really toyed up to here, turn on my welder, we're making stuff. And I can back away a little bit? Nope, that's going down. I need a way to know which way is up. That is what I need. Okay, so my perception of this is terrible. And obviously this... Oh god, I moved it. I moved it! Obviously this is a very slow way of doing this. Not very effective at all. But it looks kind of cool. Yeah? Maybe? A little bit? Okay, so what we're going to do is... Yeah, we should, I wish I could do it just line by line. But I think part of the problem is it welds blocks that are beside him. So that he wouldn't be able to just move in a line because the block would stop him. So we almost have to move like, from the inside up. I don't know. Let's try... Uh, and being able to see this phenomenally is very helpful, I think. <laughs> uh, let's try booming out a bit. Oh, I am, like, spinning that thing, I guess. What am I doing? Oh. Oh. I guess the rotor's not locked. Crane advance. Rotor landing. Advance rotor down. Breaking force. I might have rotated it. Um, how badly? Are we still able to finish it? So it's rotated that way because with its shortest distance, it can't 
it might not be able to reach the whole thing. Oh, this is going so f swell. Like, this is flawless, really. Flawless execution on my part. Is the welder still on? Yeah, okay. So let's boom out a bit. Maybe? Nope, there we go. Let's wait there for a little while. I'm going to be building most of this by hand, I think. This is going to be an epic failure. Don't judge. So what we should probably do, <laughs> if we ever want to use this crane again, um, I don't know. Having different welders that don't weld beside them might be useful. Because then we could just move it, like, logistically through it in a zigzag pattern, and that should get build everything. Um, a better way to see what was going on. So maybe if I put a camera... Let's try putting a camera on, on the actual arm and see what that does. See if I could use that to get kind of a bearing. And we'll put it on the left side. Sure. Okay, let's move this guy's thing out of there. And then we'll take a look. Skimmer, you will be born. I believe. Going up. Going out. And good. Some wonky reflections going on. It's okay. My reflection is quite wonky as well. Mostly due to my face. Okay. There we go. And just a dab will do ya. Unless you want more, then a dab won't do. You need more than a dab at that point. Two dabs. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think the hardest part is just figuring out where the crane is through that hologram. It would be better if I had broken the hologram into, like, different layers, and we did it one layer at a time. That would probably be better. I, di I didn't do that, though, so we're not doing it that way, just to be clear. All right, we have one camera there. Let's get the other camera, which is probably the only other camera here. I guess this one. Ooh, swinging in full speed. No, 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 slow down speed. Not so fast speed. Well, is it helpful? Is it? We can look at the stars. No, uh, the answer is no, it's not helpful at all. Maybe a tiny bit, but so minimal. Okay, well, I think I just wanted to weld here again, so let's just weld. We're welding. What I should probably do is do this. Control it this way. All right. What are you doing in there? Welder's not even on. I told you to weld. Clearly, I hit the wrong button, didn't I? Which means something's reversed that I'm not aware of it. And it's going to cause me problems later. Okay. There's also no sound. Absolutely no sound. No welding sounds. What if I get closer? <laughs> closer. Okay, well. Oh god. Let's just keep um, panning around, you know. Just find stuff to weld. Did you do it? Did you find stuff? Got the back part of it. That's good. Good job. We gotta like go over top and get to the drills, I think. So let's do an advanced maneuver called the turn off the welders. Uh, see which way the thing is moving. Oh, no. Is that right? Up, down? That way, yes. Okay. We'll go up. We'll go over. We'll go back down. Until we hit something. Then we panic. Panic over. Now we hit that button. Now we start welding again. There we go. I'll try to get a better angle. This is just flawless, really. It's the best way of doing this. Best. No better way. This is the only way. There's going to be so many people tell me better ways. I mean, launching it into outer space and throwing some welders after it would probably be better. I don't know. I think it's going to be fine. It's just going to be swell, guys. 
Anytime someone says swell, you know, it's it's not ending well. Okay, let's try going up. I'm ready to boom. Boom. Nope. Good. Found some more blocks. Let's let you weld them. Here, let's move you around a bit. Sometimes it's good to shake... Shake yourself loose. Don't break anything. Okay, good. Can we get closer? No. Nope. Too close. What about now? Too close. Ah! Can't see a thing. All these views are so terrible. Alright, fine. Fine. Ooh, a mining carriage. You, I don't want. Not right now. I did go ahead and move the mining hauler, if that's what it's called. Yeah. He is over by those group of asteroids there. He's that little speck underneath the two big ones. So I moved him away just because, yeah, he needed to be done. Excuse me. All right. Well, this is going so fast. Skimmer, you're going to be alive in no time. Let's do another little shake. Shake, shake, shake. What I am noticing is our performance is getting pretty bad. So there's going to be a point here, I think, where we are going to need... Oh, God. don't know what's happening. Everything's spinning. The ship's spinning. This is spinning. Spin, spin. No, go down. I want you to go down. Boop, boop. Yeah, good. Oh, God, stop. Can't see what's happening. And now pull away. I'll try placing some of those drills down there, but doesn't seem to be doing it. Where's the sweet spot? I see one drill that looks like it could be drilled. Or welded, I should say. Uh, maybe we have to boom back. Booming back. No. Booming back. Oh, yeah. And stop. And go forward again. Stay right there. It's very quiet. I don't know why, I just expect noise. And there's no noise. Oh, here we go. Yes, you placed a drill. Weld it. Yeah, but I think we're going to have to maybe move the station away from this asteroid. Depending on how quickly Skimmer can get rid of the asteroid, that is. If he could just destroy it in a day, then it might not be an issue. Just so long as we have some place to store all that ore. But what I suspect what will happen is we'll have to go away for a while, let Skimmer do its job, maybe build another ship to hold the ore here while he's working and follow him around. And then that will bring it back to the station, which will have to just be in space with no uh, asteroids anywhere near it. Because it's just too, um, it's got too many blocks. Okay, now uh, let's boom back. I said back. Oh. So the crane, while cool in as a gimmick, is terrible as a tool. Get it. Yeah, get it. Get it. You could do it. Is it that its shortest? Yeah, okay. Now it's at its shortest. Okay, and reverse. Go in. You can do it. So yeah, I'm not doing this a very good way. Oh god, I'm pushing on something. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing this a very clever way, or a way that's going to lead to this actually getting done in a <laughs> proper manner. Um, but I was hoping I could get it just somewhat done, but man, this is terrible. Well, maybe not. We got one row. There's some drills in. Okay, not bad. I mean, it's not great. So where are we right now? Right now we are right there. Uh, we lost our welder. That'll cost us. Okay. <laughs> Gonna put a welder back on and then do some work.
Okay, weld is repaired. So what I think we should do is put it pretty much right back where it was. Because that actually did look like a decent spot. So let's see what we can do from this angle. Okay. Hit something. <laughs> well, let's uh, reverse. Till we're all the way over here. Start more. Okay, we'll start right there. And I have to reset up the welder. Which is no longer that one. And now I don't know which one it is. Hmm. Where's the welder? It's all by himself. Welder 2? Builder 2. Let's go with this guy. I want it to be this one. This is the one I want him to be. This is who he is. It's probably not. I probably made a mistake. But we shall see. I made a mistake. Oh god, I just flung it. No, I didn't. I got it right. Knew it. Ah, knew it. Okay. Let's put it back. And I guess there's nothing to weld this high, so let's go down. See if we can find something. No. And I think we're all the way down now. We could boom forward. Anything? Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. Turn it off. Wait for the magic. Oh, and we got a drill. Okay, let's get rid of the HUD. Okay. Let's try... Oh, no, I need the HUD for keys. Let's try coming back a bit now that we got a drill there. Can we build anything else off that drill? No. Okay. Forward again. And I'm replacing. We'll stop. Wait till it's done. So, yeah, this is more just for fun, this build. <laughs> Definitely not practical. Definitely not an easy way to build, but it's fun. Uh, the one for the station wouldn't be kind of this pinpoint, so I don't think it would be as bad. It would like push it up. Uh, boom up. Oh, got to another layer. So we'll see how much we can get done of this, but it doesn't look like we'll be able to finish it by the looks of it. So I'll get it all ready for you for the next episode, and then we get to hopefully play around. God. Oh god, pull up. Pull up. Something bad happened. Both things are kind of going wild. Well, I'm pretty sure we lost our welder again. Yeah. Stuff started to build around my welder, it looked like. And then it got stuck. Smash. Well, a terrible crane. You're going all the way up, are you? Okay. You show us how tall you are. <laughs> you stand up tall. Well, we got like... Yeah, terrible things happening here. Oh, you got all your stuff in it. Oh, I'll just finish you off. There you go. Nice, your stuff's inside you. There we go. And maybe we could just turn these welders on. No, they don't have any parts. We will get there. We will get there. So yeah, I think I will just pick away at it. Uh, once I get most of the insides done, I might just use Tortwing or something to do his armor. Although he is heavy armor, so that's a lot of steel plague. I will see. Anyway, guys, that'll be it for today. So hope you've enjoyed. And soon, Skimmer will be reborn. Soon.